God is able. God is able. I have a dream. This is the lawn of the UVA. Come on up this way. We got, we got check in, so. Okay, we gotta check in. Yeah. All right, I just want to get a shot. Right. All right, I just want to get a shot of what's going on. Ladies and gentlemen, we're here at the uh, Rotunda. We promised to, I heard you, promised to give you some more of the UVA grounds. Is it right here? Hi, how are you? Uh, Hi. We're entering. Hi. Two flights up. We got an elevator due for two more flights. <laughs> no elevator? We've got one. We can take you outside. We have to run it ourselves. So we can oh, that's okay. Two flights up one hurt. <laughs> we're in the uh, rotunda now. <laughs> and uh, we're going up the stairs. Oh, it'd be. You might have could have brought your helicopter, huh? Oh, oh, would you need a helicopter for it to be? Well, I'm not used to doing all these climbing. Here's another beautiful view that we're giving you from the Rotunda, where we are taking the stairways up. And the statue there, it'd be. Ain't that somebody that you ought to know? Well, let me see. Who is he? What a name he is. Oh, wait a minute. See that sign? What the sign said? It says, it says, don't touch. Well, you don't supposed to touch it. Oh, wait a minute, he looks just like you. Well, you're going to see a lot of things around here. Look like you had to be. We're taking all the shots we can. Ladies and gentlemen, these stairs are really beautiful. And they are. We're gonna take a station break. So I smile, 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 smile. Gentlemen, we're here at the Rotunda. Such a beautiful place that we're at right now at the Virginia University grounds. Hi, how are you? And uh, we're giving a little interview here to the speaker. Oh. I didn't know we were being interviewed. <laughs> well, this, this is the way we do That's things. Silly, silly. This is the way GGI do things. On the uh -huh. spot in a moment. I see. Uh, you are? I'm Deborah McDowell. And she's the uh, director of Carter Wilson uh, Institute for African American and African Affairs. Oh, it'd be. Mm -hmm. And she sounds like she's some kind of your red rock uncles. Boy, shut your mouth. Don't you spill the bean. Mm -hmm. Ladies and gentlemen, we had a ball here today covering with the the uh, Ella Baker <laughs> Symposium, Ella Symposium. Baker Day. Mm -hmm. And uh, we're going to be back for later on this afternoon mm -hmm. for the conclusion of uh, this event. Mm -hmm. We'll take a station break so we can sponsor who sponsors us, sponsor, who sponsor, who sponsor us. GGI, God's made his idea has brought you another episode. Thank you. This is what we have an open vision of mm -hmm. the entire world from here, from the Rotunda. The Rotunda is the heart of the academical village, mm -hmm. and, and uh, it's where the library was located in the original design. And to the left and right, you see the lawn uh, buildings, which were the student uh, rooms and the professor's residences. Uh -huh. uh, Jim Hart has given us the, uh, the update on what's going on here and how it was uh, but, but Jim, this is the rotunda. Uh, 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 is, is there a front window to the uh, of, uh, rotunda? You are looking out. Well, we're, we're looking out of the front window. That's right. Towards okay. the academical village. Towards, towards the academic. Ladies and gentlemen, we having a ball here. You see, Jim Hart. Oh, Jim on television. Yeah, Jim is on Hart on television. This is the rotunda that we're covering now, and uh, we will be back this afternoon to continue to cover the. Rest of the episode. And it be what that is, 29? Boy, shut your mouth. At the same time, there's been a big protest about, you know, not 
moving those magnolias. Okay. And so they're trying to raise money to figure out a way to keep those magnolias there and still do the renovation. Okay. But you see how, oh, there's a All right. Yeah. So you see how these buildings are? Those, yeah. Those larger buildings are called pavilions. Uh huh. And there are 10 of them, five on each side. There's five on each side. Yeah. And there are 10 pavilions. And they had professors living in them. The professor and lives in the? In the pavilions. Pavilion. And the students live in the rooms in between. Oh, okay. And that's oh. the east lawn on that side. This is the west lawn on this side. The rotunda is at the north end. Okay. And the south end was originally designed to be open, but after the rotunda burned in 1896, that was a terrific fire. Oh. Um, and, they, and they redesigned the rotunda. Yeah. They added that building over there at the other end. Which is the Polk building, right? No, uh, that's uh, Cabell, Cabell Hall. Okay. That was, um, that was added. We're going to walk down a little bit further. Okay. George? Yeah, I'm right here. Run out of laundry in my room. Did you get my chair, Jesse? And that closed off the south, south end. Oh, but, okay. Uh, but they survived, and they've extended the south end now to that new construction that you see at the, at the far Jefferson end. Park. That's the south end. Yeah, across okay. Jefferson Park Avenue, there's a there's a whole new southern part of the grounds. We call this a campus. They call it the grounds. We're going to go all the way to the end because I'm going to show you okay. where we're going to be after the uh, okay. after the session where the reception is going to be held in Garrett Hall. Oh, okay. Hi, old yeller. That's old yeller. Uh, okay, Jim. Uh, we almost said we got to go all the way down to the end to. To the end, and, and this is part. Again. This is just as much part as the rotunda as the rotunda itself. Mm -hmm. yeah, or, yeah, that's right. Because it's all unified. This by is the a, rotunda. all unified. It all shows where the students and the. It's a little village. A village it's within an academic a, village within the grounds. Yeah on the ground. Mm -hmm. And this is how they look. You have everybody got a different a different approach to their living. And oh you see right through. It, yeah, there's such a small quarter. Well ain't number one person saying it that'd be what you thought. Oh yeah, it looks like a school to me. Oh, no. <laughs> we gotta go down these stairs. Oh these are picky stairs. And gardens in the back. Yeah. We're doing a tour on uh, the grounds of UVA. We finally got a chance to do so. Uh, earlier, we had told you that we were going to do some coverage of uh, the UVA. Well, here it is. We're doing it now, along with Jim Hart, Professor. Uh, Y'all look like the Smith Brothers. <laughs> We're going to take a station break, so our sponsor can sponsor our sponsor. Isn't it beautiful here in, on the Virginia grounds where, where we are visiting the Rotunda. And as we speak, the Rotunda is so beautiful that we are giving it all that we have. The Rotunda here in Virginia. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to take a station break so our sponsor can sponsor our sponsor. Who sponsors? Who sponsors us? EGI is a way people come together on the university grounds in peace, love, and perfect harmony. This is a statue of the young Jefferson at study at well we, we don't have the, the vision to see this but perhaps you can enjoy it over and over again another one of the points of the UVA grounds Jim Hart and I are oh there's a can lot I tell of people you the story about when, when, uh, a, a young Virginia gentleman is escorting his lady friend home. No, how does it go? Um, if 
the women and the men are of good moral standing after their evening together. Okay. And they walk past those statues. Okay. Jefferson will rise from his seat. Jefferson, right. Uh, Washington over there will raise his sword. Oh, Washington will raise his sword. Right. Oh, okay. Uh, however, <laughs> there has never been a report of that ever oh, happening. That ever happened. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good story, Jim. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to take another station break. We have, we have uh, so much to show you and so little of footage to show it to you with that we're going to be back in the second part of this celebration for Remember, Ella Josephine Baker. Not the Josephine Baker of the Paris Spain, but the, jo the Ella Baker of the Freedom Rights Movement. GGI. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen, we're rolling up the stairways to the rotunda. And as we go to the rotunda, there's a statue here that everyone knows with the bell, the angels, and the old man, Thomas Jefferson, third president of the United States of America. This is the rotunda from the front, as we showed you the rotunda from the from the back. Here on the UVA grounds where we are giving you a first class report on Ella Josephine Baker at the Rotunda. Such a beautiful sight. Yours truly along with Jim Hart. Jim Hart is giving me the history of the Virginia University ground. And we are approaching the, not them stairs, Mr. B. Oh, please, I don't want to go up them stairs no more. Well, you got to get up to the top of the uh, uh, rotunda, don't you? Yes, uh, there's only one way you can reach the top. Jim was telling me that at one time when Queen Elizabeth came here, she was hosted up from the <laughs> bottom of the stairs to the top. You know, we all can tell stories about things, but uh, it's such a beautiful grounds, and I can see why they call them grounds. Jim, why do they call this campus grounds, sir? Why? You don't know? <laughs> Give it to Jimmy. Jim don't know. No. Wait, wait, wait a minute. Is, is there's a question Jim don't know? No. Well, we don't know everything, but uh, we give you what we got. GGI, as we go to the... Rotunda, we are getting out of breath. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to take a station break so our sponsor can sponsor our sponsor. Who sponsors, who sponsors us? DGI. Happy Friday, Ella Baker Symposium at the University of Virginia. Regardless of religion or creed, every day that we are alive is a, is a good day. Is that agreed? As such, uh, for those Christians in the audience, I, I most uh, welcome you on Good Friday. So happy Good Friday to you. I want to thank all of the uh, sponsoring organizations, particularly the University of Virginia Women's Center. Uh, and has, uh, your work that you've done to put this together, thank you for all the emails and for all of the organizing. I want to thank Dr. Harold, Dr. Harold, uh, the work that she's doing uh, on rounds now with African American studies. Uh, Lauren Crittingham, I believe she's in the back. Lauren and her mother Jackie. Jackie married one of my childhood buddies, and Lauren is now a third year student here. We're both very proud of her. Uh, and Dr. Pamela Ross of the University of Virginia Hospital. Thank you all for being here. Uh, as we all know, February is Black History Month, and it has passed. March is Women's History Month, and it too has passed. Nonetheless, I will discuss American history today through the acumen and the actions of Alabama University of Virginia for its commitment to advancing equality. Before we bring on Black Voices, that uh, note that in Washington, D.C., there is a co conglomerate and collaboration of organizations that are working on these issues jointly. And so as you matriculate through the university, uh, there is a body of nonprofit organizations 
that are looking at the intersection and nexus between all progressive issues, regardless of uh, orientation, color, or gender. And so with that, I will introduce proudly Black Voices. I was a student here 30 years ago, and Black Voices was such a powerful force. And so please, bring to the stage the one and the only Black Voices of the University of Virginia. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, we're here uh, at the uh, Rotunda, and it reminds me so much of home because I've never been here before, as long as I've been in Charlottesville. And I uh, really had a ball, and I enjoyed it. Oh, well, thank you so much I'm for ready. attending. I really appreciate it. And thank you. Thank you. I'm glad you enjoyed your talk. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Very good, Jim. Jim, let me cover him, and then we're out here, okay? Uh, huh? Ladies and gentlemen, we're here at the uh, Rotunda here, and uh, we are trying to get something going on. 
I'm not pleased with that. Yeah. Right, hey, one, boy. How you doing, sir? Here, here's the home. Here's the home fellow right here. Sir. Okay, that's right. Uh, yes, sir. You know, I was thinking about you when we were, uh, you know, like back in Shy and whatnot. Yeah, yeah. And it's amazing how we are able to come together up under this that's right. spot. That's right. You know, that's right. And it means so much to me because you know I'm gonna chip off the old that's block. Right. You know? That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. That, uh, oh, beautiful. Thank you. That uh, Thank we you. will uh, be able to. Uh, do some things while we're here in Charlottesville. Okay. That's my uh, information, the uh, time and everything that come up. Uh, Good. Well, beautiful. I'm glad you're here. Gary Flowers. That's ladies right. Ladies and gentlemen, Gary Flowers, and uh, he will be, you'll be seeing more of uh, Mr. Flowers around Well, I'm glad to be here. Look forward to working with you. <laughs> Thank you, sir. All right. All right. Thank you. And God bless you. God bless you. EGI is away. We come together every day in our lifetime with peace, love, and perfect harmony. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to show you a picture of the, this is the John Hartwell. And this, this portrait here lies in the rotunda. Jim, how come there ain't a whole lot of portraits of uh, other presidents in the rotunda? Downstairs. Oh, downstairs. Okay. Okay. It's such a beautiful, it feels like home to me. See when we come back. Yeah. There, but if you look around, you see that the books are, are like in the. Uh, I can see it. I can see it. There's, there's so much we're learning about the rotunda. And if you notice, you see that the reflection from the sky is at a 4 o'clock, uh, 4 15 or 4 o'clock. Uh, it's uh, pretty unique here. Uh, we're we, we're, we're going to do a little. Explore. Lead the way, Jim. And uh, we'll be able to give you more and more of it. I'll see you Thursday, okay? Okay. Here's another gentleman that was that was doing the footage here with us, and uh, we're going to edit me. That's your part of I really don't have time, bro. I don't have time either, but I'll, I'll see you Thursday. Okay. Hi. 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 Can you have a good one? As we go down the stairs of the road tunnel, this is the one there that Jim was talking about earlier. Oh, Jim, have you ever decided to count the stairs that goes on in the rotunda? This is the statue that, caught, that got caught on the fire rail. At, at the fire and the statue got caught in the stairway where the dynamite uh, that's the way the story goes, Jim. At the dynamite ship, the statue. Oh, enemy, he looks just like you. Well, what's the difference? Uh, let's see, enemy. Mm, uh huh. Got that? Okay, enemy. Uh oh, got got a new hairstyle, huh, enemy. Well, he's still the same old man to me. Ladies and gentlemen, I ask you to hold on. Oh, this is a room. What room is this, Jim? This is the oval room? This is the board, board of visitors. The board the of visitors room. room here. This table is as long as the columns are tall. Oh, exactly. Hey, the, the tables are the same length of the columns that... Uh, and you see how the, uh, the freeze work around the, the border? Yeah. Around the, the ceiling? In all of these rooms, it's different. It's a different Greek style. Oh. style because Jefferson wanted the students to learn classical architecture while they were in the building studying. Okay, good, And they good. could see the different styles and later on we'll, we'll be able to see that. The old man thought about a lot of things, wasn't he? He sure did. I bet they called him crazy, He did too. not like stairways. Okay. So he, the original stairways were half the width of these. Uh, that when they remodeled it, they, well, half they, the width. It, they were half the width because okay. he didn't like, he wanted them out of the way. Right. And, I bet he could have invented a, a elevator back then if, if he didn't so have a part of it. He has the automatic doors over the, the automatic hotel. doors down the window. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. And they've been running without repair. Right, right, For right. 200 plus right. years. But the stairways have to be wider now because of fire code regulations. Okay, like okay. But originally, he, they, had, they were narrower. And you'll see at Jefferson, at Monticello, yeah, Monticello, the stairways, stairways look like look like they are so small. Look like you had to be a. It's out of the way. It's, yeah. It's out of the way. When you go into the main rooms, you don't realize it's there are two floors up above. Right. 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 I'll check them. 
Oh, we paint them. <laughs> this is the gardens at the, on the uh, grounds. The gardens, uh, what about the gardens, Jim? Well, they are uh, each designed uh, in a different way to provide variety of, of the flora that uh, Jefferson was so interested in seeing cultivated in Virginia. Okay. So you have Chinese gardens, you have oh. all kinds of uh, trees and plants native to Virginia. Oh. It's, it's, uh, during April is Historic Garden Week. Okay. And these gardens are, are featured. Of the garden. Hmm, very interesting. These gardens has been here for how long, Jim? Two hundred. Two hundred and thirty years. No, not quite two hundred years. Not quite. Oh, this is the, what, my God, what, what that is, Jim? It's like a Chinese tower. Oh, it's a Chinese tower. It looked like a, a totem pole. What? A totem pole. It was a totem pole. Well, that's what the Indians have to identify all of their ancestries from the, what was the name of it? Morton Spears. Morton Spire. Morton Spire. Please respect all. This historic artifact by not touching, climbing, or placing objects on it. Oh, it's about 14 feet, huh? Mm -hmm. Okay. We're having a ball at the grounds of UVA. Reason why we call them grounds, Jim? Oh, you found could, out? could you? I thought you found out. No, I'm okay. I'm I'm still trying to find out that. Well, I thought. Maybe it was because they had coffee plantations here, and uh, after you finish with the coffee, you have the grounds. Oh, the grounds. Oh, that can't be it. <laughs> we, we're going to find out the answer to that. you see, that. these rooms here okay. are parallel to the to the lawn rooms, right? They run along that way. Same, okay. Same symmetri symmetrical design. Over there where, uh, where Polk is, right? Right. Uh, that's, that's the west range. This is the east range. Yeah. Okay. And this you have the east lawn and the west lawn. Rooms. Okay. And these big buildings, we uh, have ten of those too. Okay. What were they called over there? The big buildings where the professors lived. Uh. Pavilions. Pavilions. These yeah. are called hotels. Oh, these are called hotels. Right. Okay. Well, we're having a tour on the grounds, and we said we was going to give it to you, ladies and gentlemen, and we're going to give it to you as we get it from first hand. I want to thank you for tuning in, ladies and gentlemen. And remember, GGI, it's a way we are able to walk the grounds of the University of Virginia, where we have just left the rotunda. We hope to bring you more and more. Stand by, GGI. God is able. God is able.